Hi, my name is Remington Alessi. I'm running for the Harris County Sheriff position. It's kind of, kind of an unusual thing. Uh, we took a, my campaign manager and I uh, had a funny strategy because we realized that most people don't really particularly care about sheriff races. It's, uh, it's something that any more than they care about uh, the comptroller position. Now, the reason that we figured this was probably a good idea is because I'm a strong advocate for drug law reform, prison reform, and a number of other necessary reforms that academics have been screaming for for the last 50 years and have been largely ignored by law enforcement establishment. But anyway, uh, we realize that a lot of these legislative changes are very difficult to accomplish because of the fact that ordinarily if we do happen to get a particularly righteous uh, legislator into a given legislative body, they are oftentimes quickly shouted down by the majority of uh, establishment opposition. Uh, so we realize that there's a fair amount of power in the hands of the sheriff to actually deprioritize marijuana arrests deprioritize vice crimes in general and to ultimately focus on uh, focus on reshaping the Harris County Jail which is the third largest uh, private uh, or I'm sorry the third largest county jail in the uh, country and uh, currently it's under attack because the uh, Corrections Corporation of America is currently trying to uh, take over and privatize it uh, so that they can bill the public in unlimited amounts that supposedly they're going to be efficient now, I personally think that they're more interested in creating repeat customers, but anyway, um, I just uh, wanted to talk to you guys, if, if anybody's interested, uh, pull me aside, uh, tell you all about the campaign, it's kind of, a, kind of a new approach, we're having a lot of fun with it though, and oddly we've created a great deal of collaboration with libertarians. Um, who have been very supportive of a lot of our policies. I think there's I think there's a lot of potential for us to team up with them and create a really strong third party presence locally. Uh, one of the things uh, with the local politics is there's very low voter turnout on off year elections, uh, and we Greens are obviously very politically active. And given the very low turnout on primaries and off year elections, it seems to me that focusing on the local level like we're doing now may have a lot more potential than we initially realized, perhaps even more so than a presidential election. So uh, I'm really quite honored to be part of this, and I, I thank all of you guys who've encouraged me and helped me to have the courage to stand up here. It means a great deal, so I thank you very much for your time.